Even here, then there's such a nylon rope. So you have to, this is on the finger beam. You no need to make a L angle and uh, the concrete piece like this. It will be shaped is on the beam itself. You have to start. I can keep a one millimeter gap like this. Like that. Another one like this. It will be like this. Stretching here. Then this piece is uh, acting as a keystone. You have to cut the piece to lay like this. It goes straight here, go like this. Next one you start again matching the like this. So now the joint is here. Now next one will go overlapping here. This will cut the joint will be somewhere here. Okay. So it's a keystone fits in there. Right? Yeah. Okay. So this type of term, four people can work at a times. You build like a triangle, triangle. When you reach here, then again we tie the string lengths, go up. Otherwise, if I tie entirely, then it can disturb. Sometimes you can put your head here to clean if there is some water excess of the motor is disturbing. You have to maintain very clearly. Sometimes when you press, the motor can push up the alignment. Right. Then you have to clean it, not to touch. So that's the reason we can able to go there. Then when I reach here, then I can tie more lines. Keep on doing. How do we know how much distance to keep between them? One millimeter. If you are not listening, I will put your head. No, no, put them back again. I did not see any one millimeter this time. You don't see? I didn't see. Can you? No, no, the other one too. All so they should not touch, right? So how do I know? That's the key. What I do. <laughs> That is just to level. Oh, hi. <laughs> In real project, real building, what do you put there? In real building, what do you put? Real building are only the directly fixed bits. Direct. <coughs> okay, okay. Yogesh, right. what angle should it be added in the answer? Can you tell me after? Uh, uh, how do we know to start? There is no such angle, you just have to keep it parallel to the stone. You have to rest it. Means Parallel to that angle. No, no, no. This surface so mm -hmm. should flush with this. That's all. That's all. So if I do like that or like this. You, 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 you see now that, that that's the corner coming up. So it should touch the... Uh, it should not go out of that corner. Okay, okay, okay. Means you have to maintain this profile. So we have the profile guide. Oh, I see. So you are following this face of the brick with this string. Okay. Can you continue on this? Okay, okay, okay. That is not touching. It's away from it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I think it's only fair for those who are filming to be inside. <laughs> I don't know shots that you can. Big size is not the same, no? Yeah, it's not the same. Anna, so push, Anna. Anna, big size is not the same. So one side three four, one side two six. It's always like that. Why? So he stepped the more. The keystone is like small. The two two sides are two size. The keystone is under the small. Okay. One side is three four, and one big size. Okay. That's the keystone. That's the card. Yeah, yeah.
No, full size here, three four there. No, just full size. This side full size. Yeah. This three side four. three four. Three four. After one more three four, these edges are straight. Okay. One okay. piece. Here. Okay. okay. Here to here the keystone. Keystone. Okay. okay. So the keystone will oh. go once there, once here, yes. once there, once here. One joint here, one joint here. Okay. 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 The keystone will keep. Sometimes this joint by bottom the touchy here. That side little gap, the stone fits tight. Fits tight. Next time, he didn't join, join here. You see just here, here. here. Another kind of a dome, which you are beginning from the four corners. It's a square dome. Which you are beginning from the four corners and coming to the center. Okay. So, you are saying four people can work on the Any number of people. Okay. It is a big enough then they can be two people at each corner. Okay. So how do you start laying this? Uh, how do you start laying the brick for this stuff? What is the starting point? The starting point is the four corners. So what do you do first? What, what do you lay first? It's essentially a set of two bricks which have to come together. You need to use space for a keystone. Okay. And the keystone is the one which locks the corner. Okay. The keystone is done in a pattern. Where one keystone is facing one side of the wall, the other keystone is facing the other. And this pattern is continuous. Okay. So, so this wall will go. Okay. So you begin from the four corners. The two corners will merge. It will come like this. And then it will close. Okay. In this direction. So you use the levels too. Use the levels to check the level of the brick each time. Uh, he was using a. This is one of those. To ensure that this level uh -huh. of the bricks is in one plane, otherwise this tends to curve. And if you don't know how exactly the mortar thicknesses are, okay. And of course, these strings are for ensuring that you don't go either to inside or to outside. These strings, yeah. Okay. And then we are gonna have these guys all the way Exactly. It's a very nice form from inside. Like this. So this is better than some of the other domes. I think you need a thin layer of mortar. Yes. <laughs> yep. Yeah, you need to fill the gap over here. Is it coming? Um, I'm not talking. Why? You can say yes or no. You said you'll come. I said I'll come. I came, you came at the end. The you came at the end. Alright, so you see the pattern. This and that. Right? Okay, so in the groin dome, you can see that the layer on the left and the layer on the right, uh, they alternate which goes on top of the other. You can see here, uh, in this row, the left side is laying on the right side. Next level is a right side is on top of the previous left side. So this keeps on alternating. As you go to the top, the same thing. If you come down, you have to come back again. Look at the 
So basically what I'm doing right now is uh, um, I'm just in this brick so that I'll be able to put it in this angle right here. The first brick I did, of course, was messed up. It's a little bit off. Mm -hmm. But as you can tell, the rest of them are in the center. They're supposed to line up with this pole right here. Mm -hmm. So that's essentially what I'm doing. Mm -hmm. and this brick right here, just lined it up. Okay. I'm chopping it off and setting it up in there. Anything else? Um, no. Um, I'm enjoying myself. <laughs> yeah, that's good to know. <laughs> okay, explain. Can you explain me this joint? How you're supposed to do this joint? See, things are coming from this corner and that corner. Okay. Okay. Corner. Okay. Corner. Okay. Corner. Okay. It won't happen anyway, even if you don't do it. No, no. No, if you have to continue both the layers together, yeah. Yeah. you just place this one, right? Yeah. So now we have to do it like this. Do it like this. Okay. 